Crafty friends, this is Mary, and you're watching Cards TV. September is a big birthday month in my family, and we have lots of masculine birthdays, especially. So I thought I better get started this month on those birthday cards. And today I want to show you a cute little masculine card that I made for one of my grandsons, and I used the new Cricut Artiste cartridge. This was made for close to my heart, and Melanie Brown was sweet enough to send me the Artiste cartridge and the bundle that goes with it. She is an independent consultant for Close to My Heart, and I just thank you so much, Melanie, for sending this to me. I love this cartridge. We're also going to be using Bump in the Night, and we're going to use two Cards TV stamp sets. And that would be Critter Captions and Happy Days. For the front, we're going to use Wild and Wooly. I love this little set. It's got lots of cute ones, but this one's going to go really well with the image that I've put on the card today. And then on the inside, we're going to use Happy Days. And we're going to use Happy Birthday right up here. Let me go ahead and show you the card. I think it's turned out so cute. I cut it out and I started putting different parts of it together. And before I knew it, I had it done. <laughs> so I didn't get to make it on the camera. But I've also got him on an action wobble. <gasps> Isn't he cute? I love him. Now, in the Bump in the Night uh, cartridge, you find your little brochure. And you've got a column of images here, one here, that's one, two, three. The fourth column of images is where you'll find him, and he's the fourth cut down. And I cut the back of him out of green, and then here is his teeth and eyes, cut that out of white. The black part right down here. This, I guess, is this little belly button. <laughs> and the black part of his eyes is the third cut. And the last cut is his red mouth and red nose. I think he's so cute. And I thought he was perfect for this sentiment, wild and wooly, because he looks kind of wooly with the, uh, the way he's cut on the side. And then I took the Cuddlebug Divine Swirls folder and use that on him just to give him a little bit more dimension and to make the swirls pop I used some Studio G lime green ink and just ran that lightly over those swirls and it really made him stand out gave him lots more dimension and then of course being on that action wobble <laughs> he's so cute my card is green and it's four and a quarter by five and a half I've added a red mat, and it's the same red as his mouth and nose. And that red mat is four by five and a quarter. Then I've added another green mat behind that. And you know I love all these mat layers because I, I just like the dimension of it. Just building up, and then you get your main image. But this green mat is three and three quarters by five. Then I have another red mat. <laughs> And this is three and a half by four and three quarters. Then I have a red print mat. I told you that wrong. <laughs> okay, this solid red mat is three and five eighths by four and seven eighths. The red print mat is three and a half by four and three quarters. Now I got it right. Down here I've added a little border of a print that has stars all over it. And this star border is an inch and a half by three and a half. And I will have all the cut sizes and the materials I used at the end of the video, guys. And if you want to write it down, uh, just hit pause and write that down. And then you'll have all the measurements. And I'll also have a photograph of the card on the Cards TV 
card gallery over at my blog, cardstv.blogspot.com. Now, can you see this cute little red border right here? I love that. It's like a little border of diamonds. This came from the Artiste cartridge. And that little border is on page 75. You can see why I'm loving this cartridge so much. It's got so many cute little things in it. There it is right there. It's accent number two. And I cut this at three quarters of an inch. And I put it across there to uh, go across where the two different papers came together. And I just trimmed it off to fit. I just love that little border. I'll be using this one a lot. My banner up here that I used for my sentiment is also in the Artiste cartridge. And that's on page 66. I don't have to cut my banners by hand anymore. And I never did get the notches right. Here it is right here. Accent number three on page 66. And I cut this also at three quarters of an inch. And then you can see I have a red star on either end. And then I took some lime green glitter paper and cut two little glittery stars. Those came from the Artiste cartridge. And that's on page 68. And there's the star right there. Now I cut the red stars at three quarters of an inch and the green sparkly stars I cut at half an inch. And did I tell you I cut my little well, I haven't showed you him yet, have I? Yeah, I did. I cut my little monster. My wild and woolly monster was cut at four inches. <laughs> it's the middle of the night, guys. I'm doing it again. I'm sorry. Now, let me show you the inside. The inside was real simple. I love the way it turned out. I have a red mat, and it's three and a half by four and a half. The red print mat is three and a quarter by four and a quarter. The star paper right over here is an inch and five eighths by four inches. Then under my white sentiment mat, I have another red mat, and it's two and a half by three and a half. And my white sentiment mat is two and a quarter by three and a quarter. Up here I have another glittery star. This was cut at one inch, and that's also in the Artiste cartridge on page 68. And then this star down here is three quarters of an inch on the same page. And then I took the Happy Birthday stamp from the Cards TV Happy Day set and stamped it right down here with some Memento Tuxedo Black ink. And I also used the Tuxedo Black ink for the Wild and Woolly sentiment, and that's from the Cards TV Critter Caption set. And now I've got one card done for September, and I've got, oh my goodness, I've probably got to make six masculine cards for September, and I know I have to do at least two feminine cards. It's a big birthday month in our family, September. But there he is, guys. Doesn't he make you laugh? He makes me laugh. Well, thanks so much for coming by today, guys. I'm going to bed now. And if you're still up, you need to go to bed, too. <laughs> thanks a lot, guys. Have an awesome day when you do get up. And I'll see you soon. Bye now.